योर क्वेश्चन इज फाइंड द ग्रेडियंट ऑफ द कर्व वाई इज इक्वल टू फाइव एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस एट एक्स प्लस थ्री एट द पॉइंट वेर द कर्व क्रॉसेस द वाई एक्सिस वॉट डज इट मीन्स इट मीन्स दैट वी हैव टू फाइंड इट आउट द ग्रेडियंट दैट इज नथिंग बट डी वाई बाई डी एक्स now that means we have to go for differentiation of this value so first we will go for the differentiation so they have given you y is equal to 5x square minus 8x plus 3 this 3 we can rewrite it as 3 into x to the power of 0 now your every value is in x now we will go for differentiation so it will be dy by dx is equal to 5 d by dx of x square minus 8 d by dx of x plus 3 d by dx of x to the power of 0 so this form is known as partial or you can say scalar multiple rule next we will go for our power rule or you can say power function power function power function state that if your term is in this form x to the power of n if you differentiate it you will get n x to the power of n minus 1 so now we will rewrite it as dy by dx is equal to 5 now this term is like this so here n is 2 and x to the power of 2 minus 1 and minus 1 minus 8 here n is 1 x means 1 is the power and x to the power of 1 minus 1 here plus 3 and the n is 0 so therefore we will get 0 minus 1 so this is what 5 into 2 is 10 and here comes your x 2 minus 1 is 1 this is minus 8 x to the power of 0 and plus 0 3 into 0 is 0 so we know that any number whose power is 0 is 1 so therefore we will get 10x minus 8 so this is your dy by dx next what they have told they have told us at the point where the curve crosses the y axis if you see this this is your y this is your x axis suppose the curve is like this it crosses here so you can see on y axis x is 0 so here x is 0 so now we will substitute x is 0 here so we will get dy by dx is equal to 10 into 0 minus 8 that is equal to 0 minus 8 is equal to minus 8 so this is the value for that 